Howdy campers, and welcome back to your least boring summer ever. Right here at Camp Crunch Labs, I'm Mark Rober, and this is week 11 of our supercharged summer camp experience. And because it's week 11, the penultimate week, only one episode left, that means this episode is in honor paper airplane launcher. This is one of my favorite Crunch Labs box because you just mount it on your wrist like this and you reach back and you fire the airplane. And of course, for this one, the physics principle we learn all about is springs. And springs, as you find out, are just the unsung hero of the mechanical world. I use them all the time in my builds. All right, well with that, let's get right to our mega experiment. But first, we gotta find out who our special guest is. Jimmy Kimmel, you're back! Oh, hey, wow. I uh, was about to get a tattoo. Okay, well, I saved you from that. Yeah, wow, you're thank welcome. you. <laughs> Jimmy, I think something you and I really share in common that people at home may not know is we both love a good prank. Even the simple act of leaning on my horn as my wife is walking in front of the car brings me so much joy. A classic. Same with me, like tapping someone on the opposite shoulder <laughs> is so stupid. Like, that's not funny, that's not cool, but I really get joy from getting getting someone to look the wrong way. <laughs> All right, well that is a great segue in today's mega experiment. And for that, let's head right on over to the picnic table. All right. Got some food over here. Yeah, that's what you need for a picnic table. Healthy foods too, I see. It's campers, get the heck over here. Hi, campers. Hi, Hi campers. What's up? And we got Jane, give me some Jane. Margo up top, and Felix. Are you happy campers or sad campers? Mm. Happy campers. How's the camp food? It's good. Well, Jane, we're gonna improve on that because look what's in front of you here. Quite the spread of delicious food. Yeah. What do you guys think might happen based on what you see here on the table? Then I'm gonna nom them all up in two seconds. Well, Jane, we you might want to hold off on that till you see what's going on, all right? That's my only hint to you. All right, well, I've got good news for all of you because we've got a Camp Crunch Labs first, a double special guest. In fact, I'm gonna just snap him right in here. You ready? Oh. Science Bob! Hi guys! Science Hi guys. Bob Flugfelder, kids. Science Bob, you came with something. Let's I set did. it down over here. Maybe one of you recognizes this. Oh. I know what it is. Jane, what is this? It's Jimmy's office. It's, it's Jimmy's office. Why would we have a model of Jimmy's office? Yeah, Jimmy. Well, because you filled my office completely with some kind of toxic substance. <laughs> <laughs> Jimmy went out of town, as I recall. And he let us in charge. Which yeah. he shouldn't have done. No. Jimmy knows I love pranks, and Bob and I both love science, so I feel like this is the only natural outcome. <laughs> oh my. What in the world? <laughs> That's my office! Still finding elephant toothpaste there in the office. All right, Bob, well, let's right, put let's this out of the way. Bob, why don't you tell the good folks today what we're gonna be doing? We're gonna be exploring the energy that you find in food, mm. all right? So you may notice when you eat some foods, they have a lot of energy. And Jimmy, do you know what a calorie is? Oh boy, do I, science yeah. Bob, <laughs> yeah. What is it a measurement of? It's heat, right? That's right, see? Yeah. Wow, He's a science okay. guy, it's a measurement of heat. So let's see if we can prove it. Let's prove it. All right, so here we got a gummy bear. Do you think this is a high energy food? Food or low energy food? High, high, high energy. High energy. We got a little chemical in here, and the more heat it puts out, the more energy it has. All right, you ready? Okay, we're all wearing our safety glasses yeah, all got our because we do on. stuff at Camp Crunch Labs that you can't do at home. We are trained professionals. Here we go. Ready? Three, two, one. All right, whoa. Oh whoa. my That's God. a gummy bear. That's what a gummy bear can do? That's the oh energy that a gummy bear can put out. And so that energy that's in your gummy bear goes into heat up our body and move our muscles. Wow, that's cool. What do you guys think? Should we level that up a little bit? Yes. You wanna see a bigger one? Oh yeah. Yes. Let's put a real bear in a tube. <laughs> What's the best thing about a campfire, you guys? S'mores. Well, we're gonna make some s'mores. <gasps> what do you think will have more energy? A s'more with chocolate and graham crackers or a single gummy bear? S'more. Okay, so if a s'more has more energy, should we expect there to be more or less fire? More. S'more more fire. S'more fire! S'more fire! We got a little fire in a cup here. Okay, who wants to roast the marshmallow? Okay, Jane, raise your hand first. Just be careful. Whatever you do, Jane, don't let it catch fire. Remember, we do stuff at Camp Crunch Slides you can't do at home. Jane! It's on fire! <laughs> oh, look at that. That's a good s'more. 
You know, the chocolate never gets as melty as it should. I'm gonna tell you a trick, Jimmy. You gotta let it rest. Yeah, that's hard though. The s'more you know. The s'more you know. That was good. Well done. Well, I think we're ready. We're gonna go ahead and put this s'more combination into my mouth. Into this Erlenmeyer flask. For safety, let's all step back. Step back, kids. Take cover. We're all wearing eyewear. Bob, you wanna do the uh, honors? Right. I think it's too big, Bob. It is too big. Sorry, Bob. Oh. I got you. Mm. What the? Mm. All right. Science is delicious. There we go. Some more. Whoa! Oh. Wow. All that energy. Look at that. It's glowing. Whoa! Oh. Whoa. Oh, wow. Oh, my gosh. I'm never eating one of those again. <laughs> Look at that. Me neither. Wow. I got some bad news. Your smoke alarm doesn't work. <laughs> <laughs> By the way, Jane, look at our table. See what happened? Burned. Oh boy. So I've got two cups here. What's this one say on it, Jane? That one says TNT. Okay, what's this one say? Snickers. Okay. The water level here represents the energy in a Snickers bar. The water level here represents the energy in TNT. In fact, it's a little high. Uh, let me just drink a little dynamite. If you actually look at the calories, this is the actual amount in TNT versus Snicker bars. There's more stored chemical energy in a Snickers bar than a stick of dynamite. Is that wild? Yeah. Okay, so you might be thinking, well, how come this can do so much more damage than this, right? Yeah. I was thinking that. Let's say this represents whatever, buildings or something, right? With the Snickers bar, when you eat it, do you get the energy right away or does it kind of take longer to release it? It takes a little longer. It takes bit a little longer. longer, right? So what that looks like, you eat it, you gotta chew it, you're kind of releasing that energy slowly, right? That's what happens when Felix eats too much candy. Is that right, Felix? No. <laughs> so the Snickers bar, look, it's out of energy, right? Now for TNT, what happens? Is that kind of a slow thing or is that a fast thing? Fast. So there's actually less energy here, but when it happens real fast, let's see what happens. Here we go. They all That's knock really over. Really fast. Is that chapstick? That is actually chapstick, <laughs> Jane. Good eye. So I have a question for everyone. Did you feel like this Erlenmeyer flask with the s'mores? Was that an experiment or is that a mega experiment? You go I more think it mega? was right in between. Do you guys want to go more mega or should yes. we just call it? Let's more, more mega. mega. Oh, shoot. Okay, well, I've got a question then. What if we take a gummy bear like this? What if instead of doing one little gummy bear like that, Felix, we do a giant gummy bear. Oh my God. Should we do that, buddy? No, no oh, way. Yeah, yeah. No. Jimmy says I no. Want no I part of this. Yeah. I say we vote on it. It's too dangerous, guys. Who doesn't want to do it? Raise your hand. No way. No, we are not doing this. Who wants to do it? Me. Yeah! Felix, raise your hand. Yeah. <laughs> Everybody, watch out. Mega gummy bear. In three, two, one. Look at the foam coming down on the right side. That is the most epic thing I have ever seen in my life. Oh, look at the gummy bear's eyes. Oh. <laughs> oh, it looks wow. like Bowser, but a gummy yeah, bear. Yeah, it looks like Bowser. Wow. Oh my God, wow. Oh, oh no! Oh. Fire! Oh, this is really hot. Sweet. Well, was that mega enough for you guys? Yep, it was better than that. Okay, well now that we've learned all about energy, even though it's time for bed, I'm gonna send you guys back with Snickers bars. Holy cow. Okay, I'll right, put this in your tummy, and now you know what's happening. How much energy this is gonna give you for later, all right? Get back to your tents, way past your to. bedtime. Bye. Bye. All right, let's light this TNT. Oh, Jimmy, uh, no, you voted no for the gummy bear, but <laughs> yes for the yeah, TNT. Yeah, but at this point, why not? That's I mean, true. I almost forgot. It's summer camp, and and what is summer camp without friendship bracelets? Oh, Bob, you got yeah. me a friendship oh. bracelet. So, I got you in the Crunch Lab colors there. Jimmy, this is yours. Oh wow! Wait, what? Thank you, Bob. <laughs> See, our friendship is a lot thicker. <laughs> what the heck? <laughs> Thank you, Bob. Wow. Yeah. All right, Bob, yeah, get out of here. I gotta go. Well, that was very rude, Mark. That, that was, was very rude to make Science Bob disappear like yeah, that. Yeah, well, look at the difference in our bracelets. Yeah. And you, my friend, have a tattoo to get. That's, oh, you're right. I yeah. better go. All right. What a doozy. That was our mega experiment for today. And now we get to my favorite part, which is to review your super challenge submissions. And of course, last week, you just had to come up with some kind of homemade musical instrument. So let's take a look and see what we got. Stop, stop. That's not me 
making music? What? I'll show you how. Everybody, tune your instrument. <laughs> at my door so my summer won't be a bore and i got the crunch labs boot hey cool guitar bro Sorry you have to hear this, but we made the most annoying instruments ever. So as usual, this was just incredibly hard to make a decision, but I think when it comes down to it, these four are my favorites. So if you were one of those, be checking your mail for one of our official signed Camp Crunch Labs patches for your chance to come out here for the Platinum Ticket episode, which happens to be next week. Okay, well for this week's Super Challenge, and this is the final Super Challenge, by the way, you just gotta do some sort of trick shot. So harness your inner dude perfect and just come up with something to blow my mind. Now, remember, this is week 11, so next week is our Platinum Ticket episode. So try and get your entries in as soon as possible so we can make sure to see it on time. But no matter what you do, just make sure you work with your parents, be safe, and once you filmed it, post it online, tag us at Crunch Labs with the hashtag Camp Crunch Labs Contest. That'll make sure it's valid, and it'll make sure I see it. All right, campers, well, that's it for this week. So get to work on your super challenge with the trick shots and putting your build box together. And then I'll see you next week right here at Camp Crunch Labs for our final episode. And it's gonna be a doozy. Ah, mega gummy bear. I didn't tell them about my secret stash. It's delicious.